Hey guys, if you're here, chances are you're about to graduate or have already graduated class 12th or B.Tech in Mechanical Engineering. Congratulations for that. Now you want to choose a life at sea as your career because of the dollars involved or maybe being a sailor was your childhood dream. Either way, it's very important that you see this video till the end before joining so that you enter the field prepared and avoid any future problems with your career. Let's talk about the eligibility criteria first. First of all, you need at least 60% marks in physics, chemistry and in maths in 12th standard and your aggregate percentage should not be less than 60%. Second, you need at least 50% marks in English language. In either 10th standard or in 12th standard, anyone will do. Now you will need a fitness certificate from a DGS approved doctor and make sure you do get a thorough medical examination because this will be repeated at the time of you joining a ship by a company's doctor which can turn out to be pretty strict. So make sure you get a thorough medical examination. For mechanical engineers, in addition to the above requirements, you need more than 60% marks in engineering and this figure may vary depending upon the college you decide to do your GME from. The GME stands for Graduate Marine Engineering course which you can do after Mechanical Engineering to join Merchant Navy. Now there are two ways to do Marine Engineering. After class 12th, you can either go for a straight 4 year degree course in Marine Engineering like I did or you can go for a 4 year degree course in Mechanical Engineering and then do a 1 year GME course like many of my friends have done. Let's move to the selecting a college. Okay, The best way in my opinion is through IMU CET. It stands for Indian Maritime University Combined Entrance Test. This test is held twice a year, once in February and then in August. If you pass the test, they'll allot you a college as per your rank. The second option is direct admission into a private university. Most of them are pretty shady universities and they charge you a hefty sum of money as course fees. But their entrance exam is a piece of cake. I personally don't recommend those universities, but just know that it is an option. But before you join any college, there's one very important thing you must do. That is take sponsorship from a reputed shipping company. It's very important, which I'll tell you all about in our next video. So don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss our next video. If you want to know what a day in the life of a marine engineering student looks like, See my video, The Adventurous Life of a Marine Engineering Student. The link for the video is in the description. And if you have any questions regarding Merchant Navy, please put them in the com comment section below. I'll try to answer every single one of them by making more videos. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and share this video with people you think need to see this.